Hello all, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the light that shines like eight diamonds, also known as your modern day nun, one who isn't within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching. If you would be so kind to like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Um... This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. Um, please remember that these messages may apply to your past, your present, or your future. Um, so please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. And without any further ado, we are going to get into tonight's messages. Uh, let's see what we have going on here, guys. So we have the King of Pentacles, the Nine of Wands, oh, the Death card, Knight of Pentacles, Two of Wands, the Devil, hmm, okay. Okay, so you have a, we have a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo male here, okay? Um, someone who would be seen as very grounded, stable, secure individual. Um, this person um, could be, he, his work of, or profession could be within, um, any field, but he could be a boss of some kind, a manager, um, um, someone in leadership, someone in power, an authority figure of some kind, okay? But uh, he's the type of individual that normally has his finances, money, and resources in order and together, okay? Um, he could possibly be very wealthy, Okay, with the nine of wands, this individual is, is feeling very defensive, okay, uh, pertaining to something, okay, to the point of feeling like that there is some type of, of, of sacrifice that needs to be made, okay. I feel like this Capricorn Taurus or Virgo male is feeling very defensive and wanting to make a blood sacrifice okay with the death card sitting next to it this person um is so angry is so enraged is feeling so defensive towards a younger earth sign capricorn Taurus, or virgo okay that they have be because of a decision that they made okay they have made some type of decision that they are moving forward on, okay? Um, there, I feel like there could have been something going on between this older male Capricorn Taurus or Virgo and this younger male or female Capricorn Taurus or Virgo individual here. That they have, that they feel like a sacrifice needed to be needs to be made, okay? Thus, they have come to some type of, they have clear vision on the situation. They have come to 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 some type of, of, of decision as to how they want to move forward, what they want to do here. With the devil card sitting under this person, this person has addictive patterns of behavior, okay? This person could have some type of addictions, like sex addictions, okay? Um... But this also speaks to this person being a part of something possibly very sinister, okay? This person could be a part of the occult in some type of secret society. This person, um, you know, have sold their soul and thus have made a deal with the devil, okay? Which is could be the how he came into his wealth his power, his authority, his, his, his fortune, if you will. Okay. With this, the queen of wands sits next to the devil here. This is a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo individual here. Okay. 
I feel like this King of Pentacles and this Queen of Wands are working in conjunction together. Like they are a part of some type of sinister plot together. They are both feeling very defensive towards another individual. Um, have come to a conclusion together that some type of sacrifice needed to be made. Okay, I feel like they have worked very hard. Um, put forth a lot of effort even and making something happen. Okay. Because we have the seven of coins that sits under the death card here. These two individuals have, uh, are, are very defensive. Like this, this king of pentacles and this queen of wands could be married. They're both uh, a part of something very sensitive. You see the, the man and the woman here. They are both entangled, tied to the devil here. Chained to the devil here. Um, I feel like something is going on pertaining to finances, money, or resources. Um that could be connected to this king of pentacles as well as they have been working hard to do something sacrifice someone else cause the death of someone else and i feel like it's this younger capricorn taurus or virgo individual here there it, it this card depicts a female on the card okay but you know the knights and the pages it could go either way okay so like i said this could be male or female here but i'm feeling like it may be female this person we got the three of wands that sit under the knight of pentacles okay somebody definitely I feel like this Knight of Pentacles has worked very hard even for this, this King of Pentacles here, okay? In more ways than one, okay? Like if, if this King of Pentacles is say like a manager or a business owner or something, I feel like this Knight of Pentacles could work for this individual, has had to work very hard, um, for the money either on and off of the job okay but i feel like some other things have occurred some other things have happened has taken place okay where someone has made a decision about this person and somebody's had the motivation and determination to move forward to move to, to move forward on something okay Because we have the seven of wands here a lot, okay? Besides the earth energy that's here, these, these pentacles that's here, it's nothing but fire energy here. We got the nine of wands with the two of wands, the three of wands, the seven of wands with the queen of wands, okay? I feel like this queen of wands could be the wife of this king of pentacles here. I feel like because of... Um, this king of this king of pentacles has some type of close bond close relations even an affair with this knight of pentacles individual here who maybe not only were they imploring employing but also had some type of secret affair going on behind the scenes that this individual was was giving them money for or whatever and this is their addictive patterns of behavior this is their addiction they have a sex addiction here i feel like the wife either became aware of this or have always known this okay um, if this information has been found out about, this is the reason why the pair of them are feeling defensive, wanting to make a sacrifice, wanting to get rid of this person, have made a decision to, 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 to move forward on something. Okay. I feel like this Knight of pentacles could be enduring a, not, a lot, going through a lot maybe on the job in dealings with these people on their job as well as outside the job having one having to have um courage having to have faith 
um, just enduring a lot, okay? Yeah. Yeah, somebody... Mm -hmm. Somebody tried to... Th these individuals try to bring about some type of uh, to bring some type of justice to this situation. I feel like this 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 knight of pentacles here with this this queen of wands here try to bring some type of balance, some type of justice to a situation. Okay. Um, that they had with dealing with this person. I feel like with them being chained and tied to this devil here, there were some things that were done behind the scenes um, that I feel like they involved this person in, okay? Initiated this, this Knight of Pentacles into here with the Magician card here. Um, dark magic practices, um, witchcraft, sorcery, um, occultic knowledge, secret society type of knowledge, um, initiating this person, black magic, voodoo practices and different things like that. Okay. So yeah, to bring it, it, it and they did this in an effort to try to bring about some type of change. Okay. Pertaining to the situation that was going on. Yeah. And this change, they wanted to, <clears throat> they wanted this cycle to complete. They wanted something to come to an end with the situation, either with this person or with someone that they were dealing with. Okay. I also feel that um yeah oh i also feel that this king of pentacles i feel this knight of pentacles was in relations with definitely had some type of relations with this king of pentacles here okay um, as well as they do this queen of wands here. And I feel like all three individuals try to come together against another person. Okay. They, they, they try to, they try to set somebody else up, sacrifice someone else as a group, as a trio together. This king of pentacles, this knight of pentacles here, as well as this queen of wands, try to come together and, and, and bring about some type of justice to get somebody locked up, to get someone in prison. They wanted to sacrifice uh, someone else okay and I feel like this is this individual was someone that was in the life of this this knight of pentacles okay because I told you with the devil card here in the magician card here this knight of they brought this knight of pen they had this person had a very close bond with them they brought this person in initiated them into something sinister something um, to do with secret societies, occultic knowledge, and different things, okay? There was someone, I feel, and we have the Queen of Cups here at the bottom of the deck here. There's a Queen of Cups that was in the life of this, this um, Knight of Pentacles here, which could very well be a Queen of Pentacles, okay? With the woman depicted on the card here. They, this, this Knight of Pentacles with this King of Pentacles here and this King of, and this Queen of Wands came together to try to set up, sacrifice this Queen of Cups. And they went so by doing, they, they, they used different measures to do so, okay? They first tried to get this person locked up. They went and lied, used this, this King of Pentacles has connections with law enforcement, with people and other people in power. And this Knight of Pentacles not only is screwing this man, but 
works for this man, getting money from this man, been initiated into some type of secret society, satanic cult, okay, doing, been, uh, you know, sold out, was co coerced into selling out to the devil, selling their soul, taking part in black magic voodoo practices and all kinds of things, okay? So the plan was to set this queen of cups up here, this Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio individuals. They first tried to do so by lying on this person, by having trying to get this person arrested, by trying to get this person put in, in, in prison or institutionalized or something like that. Okay, when that did not work out, they tried to sacrifice this person and take this person's life. Okay, and in between doing that, they were doing witchcraft, sorcery, black magic, voodoo on this person as well. Okay, to bring about, yeah, see here get that water sign again. That's at the bottom of the deck. They were doing, they, they stopped at nothing. This trio of individuals, see this night of, 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 of pentacles here. Okay. And because we have so many other pentacles here is why this night came out. But this person could very well, I feel like is a queen of pentacles. This is a female here who is not only in a secret love affair getting paid for having sex with but this is also their boss a uh, owner a mentor or something works for this person in more than one way this person was also initiated into a secret society initiated into a cult introduced to satanism satanic practices and different things through this person okay as well as his wife with the queen of wands here They, like I said, this Knight of Cups here that just came out was in the life of this Knight of Pentacles here, okay? They stopped at nothing to set this person up to work against this person, okay? And they have stopped at nothing, okay? They wanted to bring about some type of change by bringing an end, a completion to this person. They first try to lie on this person and set this person up on a crime to get this person in prison. And then they 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 set out, they sought out to blood sacrifice this person, to have this person killed, okay, to cause this person's death, okay? And all of this was done in an effort for this Knight of Pentacles to get a large lump sum of money from this King of Pentacles here. Okay, who promised them a large lump sum of money. She owes this person a blood sacrifice. She owes this person a blood sacrifice. So if this, so basically this Knight of Pentacles here, if they were in a relationship with someone else, this person was in a relationship with this Knight of Cups, okay? Or another, we're just going to say it like this. This earth sign here, Capricorn Taurus or Virgo was in a relationship with a Pisces Cancer or Scorpio. This this Capricorn Taurus or Virgo owes their 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 boss, their manager, their owner, as well as this person that they're having an affair with. They were getting extra money from about under behind the scenes, under the table, and different things. Owes this person a blood sacrifice. This person has given this person a lot of money and all this other kind of stuff, okay? But because this person sold a soul, because this person is a part of this 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 sex ring, this uh, this satanic cult, okay? They have dues that they have to 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 pay, things that they have to go by. This person owes a blood sacrifice. And so this person was going to use this person that they was in a relationship with, this Pisces Cancer or Scorpio. And either they were going to have this person sacrifice or if this person has a child, okay, was going to have them sacrifice, okay? And I feel like, I feel like, Either way it go, it would have been a sacrifice here because they tried to bring about some type of justice here. 
and but it was a sacrifice okay it's because these people are sold out to the devil here and as well as the nine of wands they were making a sacrifice they wanted to sacrifice this person's life so they was going to have this person locked up this pisces cancer scorpio get this person maliciously locked up by lying on them in a court of law perjuring themselves lying on this person to set this person up to get them locked up and if this person has a child they were going to this child would have been left with this capricorn taurus or virgo that this person would have gave over uh sold to this 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 king of coins here that probably would have had this child trafficked or sold to the highest bidder uh and, and because they are connected to human trafficking sex trafficking and different things as well as well with the satanic cult that they are involved in and this yeah didn't i tell you we got the high priestess here Secret knowledge, secret information, occultic knowledge. This is, you, they, I told you, they are a part of a secret society. Satanic cult. Okay? Sex ring, prostitution ring, satanic occult. Okay? Where they practice sex magic, black magic, voodoo. And all different type of demonic practices here. You got the devil here, the magician here, the high priestess here. This is straight up Satanism, straight up, straight up secret society, satanic cult energy here. Yeah. But see, them trying to pull this off brung about some type of conflict here. Because, see, they were trying to cause this ending in this person's life. They were trying to sacrifice this person. And they have not been successful with doing so. Thus, this has brought about some type of conflict here. I feel like their plan has, has been exposed, okay? And this may has now backfired onto this younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here. They could be... Um, in prison, get in prison or be arrested for the malicious, evil, wicked things that they were doing to try to set, set up this Queen of Cups here. Okay. They were also doing this in an effort to, to steal some type of money here. Okay. Because we got the nine of coins that sit here and behind the Queen of Cups. This person may have had some type of money or inheritance or prop or something coming to them that they were also trying to steal in order for it to be stolen and given to this, this uh, Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This was money that th th there's a king of swords here. Okay. <clears throat> this money was coming from... Either this person's father or this is a family member. This is Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini who is the father or family member some type of way to this Queen of Cups that was supposed to receive this Knight of Coins here. And they have done everything to try to block this, to try to stop this, or they actually did some malicious things behind the scene, even in a court of law, falsifying documentation, doing other things to steal this and may have been successful with stealing this from this person but see they thought that they was going to be able to sacrifice this person kill this person by now yeah yeah they even went as far as to spread gossip lies slander rumors disinformation misinformation they used a lot of deception and manipulation here to try to set up this queen of cups okay yeah they spread a lot of gossip and they used a group of individuals okay to do this to bring about burdens on this person okay yeah they did this to bring about a bunch of burdens on this person. To, to have this person frowned upon, looked down upon in some type of way. But they were, they were setting this person up behind their back. They were trying to sacrifice this person. 
They literally all work together, a whole group of them all work together to try they 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 stopped at nothing they tried to get this person imprisoned they tried to get this person uh uh or in, in, imprisoned or institutionalized okay then they 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 sought out um hiring a hit hitman and and all and doing black magic and voodoo and all type of satanic practices even going as far as to have this person targeted and this king of pentacles here he has a lot of money he got a lot of connections. He paid. He he has enough money. I mean, this person has a lot of money. This person is somebody in authority, somebody in power. This person got connections with politicians in the state that he's in, in other states as well. Even with these third-party companies and things like that. For those of you who don't know, uh, these 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 gang stalking headquarters, these third-party companies, these gang stalking haircuts, they're in Texas. I wouldn't be surprised if this person is from Texas. They might not live in Texas right now, but they definitely still got connections to Texas. This person played a big grip, a large amount of money to have this Queen of Cups targeted. To have this person's privacy invaded and violated. To have this person's human rights, civil constitutional rights stripped from them. To have this person stalked, gang stalked, harassed. To have this person illegally invaded and violated. This king of pentacles committed all kinds of crimes. Hate crimes. Domestic terrorism. Okay? Cruel and unusual punishments and everything. And this, this, this king, this, 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 excuse me, this knight of pentacles here, this person, and, and this person is a full grown adult, spirit is telling me. This knight of pentacles, only reason why this came out as a knight of pentacles is because this person is a little, is, is rather younger than this man. This man here is about 70 some years old, 60 some, 70 some years old. This, this woman here, I believe this is a woman. This Knight of Pentacles here that works for this man is in their 30s. Okay. And this, 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 this Queen of Wands here is either this King of Pentacles wife or this is somebody else that's closely knit to this, this, um, this Knight of Pentacles here. Or either, either a family member or the person that they were trying to sacrifice or a family member to them, okay? Or either the wife to this king of pentacles, okay? But they all chained to the devil here. They all chained to the devil here. Yeah. And see, this was all hidden. This was all secret knowledge. Secret, infor secret information. Occultic knowledge was used, okay? Had this person set up. Had this person targeted. Yeah. Yeah. They to, to have some type of hope, wish, or dream come true. That they wanted to come true to get rid of this person here. They, they committed ultimate betrayal here. They, they stabbed this person in the back ten times or more. This person got a gang of people, a group of people to work against them, targeted this person, stalked this person, harassed this person, and illegally invaded and violated this person, illegally surveillance this person, even in the privacy of their own home, put taps on this person's phone, put trackers on this person's car, hacked this person's uh, uh, personal information and accounts and everything. These people in these people committed all types of crimes. And because of this man's amount of money he had, because of this man's connection to, to dirty, crooked politicians, police officers, government officials, and everything, they have gotten away with this for quite a while. This has just, just happened. This is something, yeah. An entire family. Entire family was in on this. This is it. Yeah, they took a leap of faith. And did several different things to, to abandon this person, isolate this person, leave this person, uh, uh, neglect this person, leave this person with nothing. They even tried to cause this person to be homeless, to be broke, have them out on the street without food, without support, without help of any kind. This is disgusting. 
And to think that your United States government is linked up with these people as a part of this, have sat back and watched this, know full well that this is going on, and they sat back and they did nothing about it. This is the same government that tells you that they tough on crime, the same government that tells you that they, they are abs they absolutely opposed to terrorism and terroristic acts. Yet this is the, th this is the type of thing that's going on in your United States of America. These people are habitual liars, okay? Because it's all about the money. The more money you got, the more power you got in these here United States of America. So you want to set somebody up to be killed? You want to uh, uh, set somebody up to be locked up and be imprisoned in some type of way? You want to do black magic and voodoo on somebody? You want to target some darn body and have their human rights, their civil or constitutional rights, their pursuit to happiness? Whatever happened to justice and liberty for all. Whatever happened to this being a free world? When you got sorry, low down, dirty, old, good for nothing, low down, dirty, freak nasty, sold out ass bastards with money like this. That's got connection to, to, to politicians and police officers and different shit. Fucking their employees. Got the employees trying to tricks for them for a little extra money. Meanwhile, while you set up other people, while you abuse your authority, you abuse your power, and you push your damn money around. Yeah. Sadness. They want to bring this person sadness, loss, misery. Yeah. Heartache, heartbreak, pain. This is what they want to do to this person. This is what they wanted to do to this person. This is sick. This is seriously sick. But I feel like this has been exposed. And see, this was going to be their hope, wish, or dream come true. They've been trying for years to get this person in prison, to get this person locked up. Okay? This was going to be their hope, wish, or dream come true. To sacrifice this person. And if they was able to do so. This low down dirty best to hear. Promised this person a large amount of money. This person here. That, that, that was that was tricked. That was coerced. Into selling their damn soul. And they ass. For the devil. For the love of money. Of course. For the love of money. And they did this to a, to a, to a queen of cops here. They did this to this queen of cops. This is sick. Cause this person extreme feeling, overwhelming emotions about w w what was being done, what was going on. Abandoned this person, neglected this person, left this person out. Robbed this person of what was rightfully theirs. Just so they can get rid of this individual. This is sick. Somebody that's a hermit. Somebody that stay to themselves. That don't even bother anybody. They cause burdens on this person. Problematic situations. Put a lot of heavy weight on this person. They didn't care. All they cared about was some money. All they cared about was getting their way. Yeah. All they cared about was this large lump sum of money. All this 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 Capricorn Taurus or Virgo cared about was 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 getting this large lump sum of money here for trying for taking out this person, sacrificing this person one way or another. Would it would have put them in the ten of coins? So they took a faith. They took a leap of faith, and they went along with it. This is sad. This is sick. This is sick. These individuals in conflict, in competition with, the, with this person. Competition, jealous, envious. Individuals. Competition. Yeah. An entire family came together. See, I'm telling you, this younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here works for this king of, of pentacles here. And whether he is uh, actually an earth sign or not, he's coming out as an earth sign because this is a person that is in power. This is a person that is an authority figure. This is a person who has a lot of money. Okay? This 
younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo works for this King of Pentacles. Okay? In more ways than one. So they sold and sold their ass to the devil for this individual here. Yeah. This motherfucker say jump. Excuse my lady. He say jump. This chick here gonna say hi hi. Yeah. This old daddy Warbucks here. And see, this Queen of Wands here is either this man's wife or this person's mother or the mother of the person that they they was trying to sacrifice. This person was in on sacrificing and setting up this person as well. They all work together. They all are sold out to the devil. All three of these persons. As well did they work with individuals from this person's family. Okay, the entire family is was in on the setup, went along with the setup. Took the oaths, made the decision to stay quiet, to not say anything, to go along with the setup. Yeah, so they could try to cause this tower to collapse in this person's life. This is sick. This is sick. Now these people sitting up somewhere in mental conflict about what they've done because this has been exposed. It's out. People like me have been, been exposing this shit and what they're doing. And the world needs to know this. You might find this amusement. You might not be dealing with this or going through this or whatever. You might find this to be amusing. Okay? But it's valuable information. And you need to know because you can go through this as well as somebody close to you could go through something like this. You never know. As long as you got bastards around here high up in power with a whole lot of money. Thinking they bigger and badder than everybody else just because they got money. And because of that they feel like they can do whatever the hell they want to do. Just like back in racist slavery ass fucking times. You know, what is the point in the justice system? Huh? These people want to play God. They want to be they want to be the judge, the juror, the executioner, and every fucking thing else. They picking and choosing on who the hell they want to sacrifice. Who the hell they want to die. When the hell they get ready. Who the fuck are they? You want to decide who the hell you want to set up to get locked up. Who the hell you want to set up to die. Who the hell you want to invade and violate. Who the hell you want to strip their goddamn rights from. That's not how it go. You're not no God. You're not nobody's judge. That's not how the judicial system works. A man or woman in these here United States is innocent and to proven guilty. And I don't give no damn about your position, your title, your role, or how much damn money you got. You do not have the right to illegally invade and violate a person. You do not have the right to have a person stalked and harassed and targeted. You do not have the right to strip the privacy, the, the, the human rights, the civil and the constitutional rights from somebody because the fuck you feel some type of way about them. If you really even know them. You do not have the right to terrorize and torture someone. You do not have the right to cruel and unusual punishment. I don't give a damn who you are. In these here United States. If a person has committed a crime. First of all. The way the justice system works. If there has been some type of crime. That a person is going to be charged with. That's what, that's what the judicial system is for. They get warrants. Question. Suspect. Or whatever. However. Law enforcement individuals build their cases. This is not for random outside individuals that decide they want to sacrifice some damn body, decide they want to call somebody's damn death, decide they want to try to forcibly lock some damn body up. Because you will sell out to the damn devil, because you done sold your soul. Because you done took oaths in your satanic fucking occult. 
I don't give a damn who you worship. What set you claim? Including Lucifer. You don't have the right to do this shit. And even a man or a woman who has been who has been accused of a crime. There is a proper protocol. You still have to follow rules, regulations, and bylaws according to the law. Because if you don't, nigga, guess what? Your law says that legally, bindingly, any law, any any uh, honorable sitting judge will smooth dismiss this shit and throw it the fuck out of court because you have invaded and violated this person's rights. I know my rights. Instead of you trying to get over on the law, you should know the fucking law. This illegal shit that you're doing is not even admissible in a court of fucking law. You can't go in. I don't give a damn who you are, what your position is, or how much money you have. What you cannot do, even if you got, even if you got a judge who is dirty, paid off, and in the pockets of the powers that be, what you could not legally do is go to this man or this woman's courtroom, stand before them in a court of law, and tell the entire. Uh, a courthouse as well as the judge that you have stalked a person that you have targeted a person that you have invaded and violated the human rights of a person the privacy of a person that you use illegal technology on a person that you uh uh, uh acquired uh um unwarranted surveillance taps or anything on this person that you hack this person track them you can go to the court of law and tell them that this judge would, would smooth hit that gavel and, and dismiss your ass. Because you would have to be a stone cold fucking fool. You couldn't even legally do that shit. This is the reason why these coward bastards shake and move the way they do in secret. In secret. Thinking because they tied to secret societies and, 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 and Satanism and, and Luciferianism. And all this demonic shit that they're part of, that they untouchable, and they can just go around here doing whatever the hell they want to do to people because the fuck they got money. Because they could just abuse their authority and abuse their power whenever the hell they get ready. Yeah, that's not how the legal system works. But that's exactly what the hell happened here. What is going on here? Okay. Thus, at this point, something, I feel like this has been exposed. But I feel like these people still have stopped at nothing. They still doing they, they witchcraft, they sorcery, they black magic, they voodoo. Because whoever the handlers are, are forcing them to continue doing certain shit. To attack a person. They still try to push to set a person up to cause conflict in a person's life, to bring something to an end, to bring about some type of change. And, and, and they trying to do so by use of, of, of the, the occultic knowledge, the secret knowledge, and they tie to secret societies to try to set this person up. They still have stopped at nothing. Even after being exposed, after it has clearly been exposed, what they have done. They're continuing to attack this person. But see, the only thing that they have done is they have exposed themselves, exposed their own families, exposed the government. Because they tied to these motherfuckers. You got to know, with this much going illegal going on, they are tied to motherfuckers high up in power and in government. Even higher power than this individual here. This individual just could be a business owner who is very wealthy. You understand? And see, this individual is very defensive about this situation because this information has been leaked. See, now they at risk. By law, legal law, 
of, of, of regular law in order. Real law in order. Because this has been exposed. Of being prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Because of the wicked shit that they have done. In secret that they thought was not going to be uh, 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 known about. Or found out about. This has been exposed. These people could even have already been questioned or being questioned or have already been in prison in some type of way. And if not, definitely are being watched because this situation has been exposed. They try to have this person stuck, restricted, unable to move, in prison. Because this person, and it is because this water sign here is, this, this water sign here has secret knowledge, has, has information about secret knowledge, secret information. Occultic knowledge. This is why, this is the real reason why they're trying to set this person up. They're trying to set, they try to set this person up to shut this person up is what they tried to do. They figured if they either got this person locked up and imprisoned or got this person killed, then it would shut them up. Because this person here is, is, it is a high priestess. Is a light worker. Okay. Can be a magician within themselves. And see, they don't like that. You know, this occultic leader here, he don't like that. And considering the fact he's having an affair with this person here, he didn't like the fact that this person was connected to this person. So he was going to use this person. He literally used this person to set up this person to get a sacrifice and promise this person a large lump sum of money for doing so. Yeah. That's what happened. So to break it down in layman's terms for you, this person here, this younger earth sign Capricorn Taurus or Virgo, which is around their 30s, has tried to, has, has been a part of the plots, plans, the schemes, the setup of their ex-lover. In conjunction with their boss, as well as their secret affair on the job level for money. And this queen of wands here. And the rest of their family. They all came together to set this water sign up here. To set this queen of cups up here. This Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio individual. All because this person is awakened. All because this person is a light worker. All because this person is a healer. All because this person is 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 an empress, is a high priestess. All because this person can see straight through them and what's really going on. And I feel it has spoken out about this because of the fact that they are psychic. Because of the fact that they're highly intuitive. Because of the fact that they're naturally empathic. They have used their 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 skill, their talents, their skills, their abilities, their spiritual gifts to enlighten others, awaken others to what was being done to them. The fact that they have been targeted. The fact that of everything that has been done to them. And this was literally set up by this person's ex-lover who linked up with their boss that was also their lover, on the job of fair lover that was paying them this prostitution here to sacrifice this person. This person literally linked up with th this person's mother as well as as, as as they boss or some shit to sacrifice their ex-love. As well as this person's child. This person have a child. They tried to get this person 
the the initial plan was to try to get this Queen of Cups locked up and to abduct this person's child or sacrifice this person, either try to either, either to kill this person, have a child sacrifice and kill this person's child, or have this person's child human sex trafficked. They was going to lock this person up and then human sex traffic their child or either uh, blood sacrifice this virgin child. Yeah. Because blood sacrificing a virgin child brings one a lot of power and authority within the occult. Sacrificing virgin babies on altars and shit. And the other ones, they just they just sex traffic and turn into sex slaves. Like this individual here. Nothing more than a sex slave. For money. Yeah. 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 For money. This person linked up with individuals on their job. Linked up with a group of individuals on their job to, to, to hurt, to harm, to sacrifice. Four of ones here with the hermit. This queen of cups is hermit. This person to they sell. By they sell. Go within. Do a lot of thinking. This person, you see this light that they carry. This person is a light worker though. This person is a healer. This person is highly intuitive, naturally empathic. This person is awakened. They didn't like it. So they set this person up. This person, it, it was part of the plan all along. This person, the whole time they was in a relationship with this person, they was probably uh, uh, poisoning this person, doing black magic voodoo on this person. This person was trying to knock this person off the whole time while they was together. I feel like at some point, this queen of cups figured out what was going on and left this person. And that's when they got in haste. To, to set this person up to be killed, to be locked, anything that they possibly could to knock this person off. But th this has been a long time. They've been at this for a long damn time. I ain't been able to pull it off yet. This is sick. This is sick here. Yeah. Spirit say sabotage. They try to sabotage this person for the love of money. Once again, I just did a reading. Betrayal for the love of money. I feel like this is a part of that. Sabotage. They literally tried to set up and set. They sabotaged this person. In order for money. These earth signs is all they care about. It's money. This person will do anything for money. All they care about is status. Being flashy, clothes, new clothes, new shoes. Being flashy, having a lot of money. This is sick. This is absolutely sick. Family disloyalty here. Jealousy, envy, hate, betrayal. This is this is ultimate betrayal. Yeah. Now these individuals send back Miss Spirit say these individuals these these MFs going crazy. They send back going crazy. Yeah. Spirit say they nothing but money hungry gold diggers. Okay? They do a whole lot of low down, dirty, freaking, nasty doings in the dark. What's done in the dark here. Okay? Yeah. They 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 into these sex parties, these orgy parties. These 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 witch coven parties where they get together, they do black magic voodoo and rituals and all kinds of shit here. Yeah. Got people spying on you. These individuals were spying on this person, stalking this person, following this person, watching this person. Yeah. What I tell you? For money. Spirits say these individuals is a low down dirty shame. Yeah, these people got nothing but bad vibes all around them, okay? They full of nothing but hate, envy, jealousy, and even obsession. They became obsessed with this person, with trying to hurt this person, harm this person, kill this person, get rid of this person by any means necessary. Spirits say these individuals are cowards. 
Yeah. They left this person out in the cold. Yeah. See, they, they tried to recruit this person, but they couldn't get this person to sell out. They tried to trick this person and recruit this person into their bullshit to get them to sell their soul. Like they was going to get some type of good deal or they was going to get a large amount of money if they would sell their soul. They couldn't. It was a trick, though. It was a trick of the enemy. They couldn't get this person to sell their soul. This person didn't care what the hell they said they were going to do to them. When they said, oh, we're going to lock you up, you're going to sell your soul. This person didn't care because it was a lie. When they said, are we going to kill you if you don't sell your soul? This person didn't care. They been ready to go. They going to go with grace. Why? Because they soul intact. And they won with the divine. When it's time for them, they ain't going no damn where to the most high ready for them to go. Not when no Decepticons and some soul, they soul decide they ready for them to go. So when they said that, this person didn't care. They couldn't get this person to sell their soul. Oh, this a good deal. You can get a deal. A deal for what? This person ain't even committed a crime. Ain't been charged with a crime. Innocent until proven guilty. What are you talking about? Take a deal. A deal on what? A deal for what? They try to trick this person into selling their soul. They try to trick this person to become a gang stalker. Like them. They try to trick this person to being a part of their prostitution ring. They try to trick this person to being a part of they 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 uh 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 um they sent they satanic cult. They witch coven. This person went by this shit. They like, this person's like, uh-uh, I'm not with that hocus pocus bullshit. This Capricorn Taurus or Virgo, this young Capricorn Taurus or Virgo that's around their thirties, in their thirties, they did love spells on this on this Queen of Cups. They did love spells to block this person's love life here. Yeah. These people behind this, this Queen of Cups back, they was having gatherings and celebrations. They was having all type of meetings about this person, what they were going to do to them, how they were going to do it, and all kinds of things. Yeah, spirits say these individuals ain't nothing but tricksters here, okay? These individuals even got a doppelganger of this Queen of Cups here to try to play pretend like they are this person, stole this person's identity. Spirit say, you can't trust anybody. Damn sure not these people, okay? These are the type of individuals. They say to sellouts. Some of them try to play pretend like they they uh, they uh Christians and different things. They uprighteous, upstanding pillars of the community, hard workers and shit. They gang stalkers. They satanic sellouts. Yeah. These individuals, they this 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 damn king of king of pentacles here was even gonna try to won't trigger this 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 um this woman here, this other Capricorn Taurus of Virgo individual to to kidnap this person's child to get this person kidnapped. Okay, they didn't do nothing but cause a whole bunch of confusions and illusions here. Okay, yeah. These people are energy vampires, okay? They energy vampires and they try to steal this person's joy. They try to steal this person's happiness here. Yeah. They try to keep this person from having new beginnings. Yeah. They was having house parties and get-togethers and all kinds of things. Sex parties, I told you. I told you. Yeah, spirits say that, that this Queen of Cups had to protect her energy from these predators. These people are predators here. They straight up predators. They didn't want this person to be successful. Spirit says these individuals is dangerous here. Yeah, these people got fiery anger. They get outraged. They mad as hell about this. About the fact that this has been exposed. About the fact that this is known about. Okay? And I feel like this person used their talent, skills, and abilities to expose this to the world of what's going on, just like I'm doing right now here. Spirits say that this person, this, this Queen of Cups, their family, what I tell you, your family, your fake friends, your no good ex-lover, that's this person right here, this Capricorn Taurus of Virgo, and the government came together to try to destroy you. There it is. There it is. They even used old prison rat, jail rat as individuals to try to set this person up. Yeah. Yeah, what I tell you? They satanic sellouts. They in a satanic occult. They in witch covens. This is not a game. They try to sacrifice this person. They are part of secret societies. Yeah. They 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 worked against this person because this, this person is gifted and talented here. Okay, this person even got fake love from their father and everything who obviously was part of the whole setup. This is crazy. 
Yeah, this is crazy. Mm -mm. Yeah, didn't I tell you? These people are part of a sex ring. This Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here, the younger one here, they're part of a sex ring. All of them. Part of a sex ring. This was just one of, of many of our clients. They're part of a sex ring. That's the reason why they had these dark parties and different things. They're part of a sex ring. This is how they get their money. They extra money. These people, I'm not saying these people, that that's all they do. They don't have no regular jobs. They got regular jobs. Some of them. Some of them. That's the, that's the decor. That's the cover. These are the type of individuals that look like they hard working, might look sweet and innocent, be nice and all this other kind of shit and be stone cold devils and you never fucking know it and that they are part of all this sinister ass shit. That's these type of individuals. That's these type of individuals. They secret hoes. They, 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 they secret Satanists and shit. You would never know. You would never know. Somebody got involved or was a part of a drug bust here. This Capricorn Taurus or Virgo might have been with some individuals, around some individuals, um, uh, and got busted with some drugs. Or either this person, uh, if they were apprehended or arrested, they had drugs on them. Okay? Some type of drug bust went on. Yeah. We got internal affairs here. So there's there's some people internally within the government that, that is aware of this, that knows about this. Crooked individuals that is a part of the setup and on the setup as well as um, individuals who ain't a part of it but know that this is going on and know what is happening. This is sad. Yeah. These Satanists wanted to steal this person's spiritual gifts from them. This is the reason why this younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo was so jealous of them. They was jealous of this person's beauty, jealous of this person's talent, skills, and abilities. Just, just jealous of this person. They tried to set this person up to be kidnapped and raped even. They wanted this person brutalized. Try to get this person kidnapped, raped, tortured. These folks are sick. Who set a person up? What type of woman set up another woman to be kidnapped and raped? This person is sick in the head. This shit has been done to them. This is how they was initiated. This is how they were broke in. You don't even have a heart, a soul, or a mind when you a woman and you set up a woman or a child to, to, to be raped? Oh my God. Spirit say, your family is using you for money. I told you that Ten of Cups came out. The entire family's in on the setup. They was trying to use this person for money. They was all involved. They was all sitting back waiting to get the call that this person was either dead or locked up or gone in some type of way so they can get a large lump sum of money. Yeah. Spirit say that they effed up a long time ago. They've been getting watched. They've been getting watched. A lot of things that they've been doing has been seen. Spirits say they effed up a long time ago. This is sad. Yeah. They even sat back trying to copy this, had people to copy this person's style, copy this person's work, copy like everything. This is sad. Yeah. Didn't I tell you we got where your boss at? This king of coins is this. Uh, this, this knight of coins, this young, and reason why they came out, this person, this woman came out as a knight, not because they real young. This is, this is a person who is like in their thirties. Okay. But this, this king of pistol, this, this, this is this person's boss. They work for this person. As well do they fuck this person for money outside of work. Where your boss at? Well, my ladies up in here, they like to talk back. Look, I want to see ya, I like to meet ya, what you said, she ain't no diva, <laughs> hey, spirit say, stay away from this psycho, okay, you know this person, you, you involved with this person, like, I feel like every person that's, in, that's even got into a relationship with this person, like, this person has a whole different persona depending on who they deal with. They in the business of setting up every person that they have been in a relationship with. 
This person is also bisexual. This person comes off as they a lesbian. On the surface, they seem like they're being in a serious committed relationship. This person is really bisexual. This person will swear up and down, argue you down that they have not been with a man before, but they have. On the surface, this person do like women though. Is attracted to women. This person is 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 very freaky. Is into a lot of things, but this person is very evil. This person is chained to the devil. Okay, but don't let this person fool you. If this person, you know this person, and and they claim they're a lesbian, and all this other kind of stuff, especially if they're a stud. Okay, they go. Spirit say this person is pure evil. The devil got demons in them, wickedness in them. Dark seek uh, 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 spirits and different things in them. Mm -mm. I feel like every person this person has been in a relationship with, she set up. Like this is this person is chained to the devil and so far gone. This is a devil's helper. Anybody. Like, this person is dangerous. This person could be triggered and snapped to kill your ass, they tell. And this is the type of person that's, like, not just going to, say, kill something or kill someone. Because this could be, this person's into animal sacrifice, too. This person is not just going to, like, kill someone or kill some. This is a person who would mutilate your body, who liable to cut you open. Maybe taste a part of you. Drink it, something. Very gruesome and nasty. This not like a person. Oh, uh, I done blacked out. I done wigged out. Pow, I done shot you. And then I'm drive off. No, this is a person. If they had the space and opportunity, like. If they hurt you, you live with this person. They hurt you. I mean, it's only y'all there. And, and they did something to kill you. They they would do some ritualistic sinister shit with your body type of shit. This person is a shepherd for the devil for real. Any person that comes into this person's life or that comes in this person's life, they set them up. They get them, they try to back them up against the wall and set them up to either uh, convince them to sell out and sell their soul so they can be a part of the prostitution ring too. Or if not, if you won't go along with it, they set you up to sacrifice you. That's how it go. Every person in this person's life, they do that. They set them up to 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 either get them to sell out and be a part because a part of the shit that they in is 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 them collecting souls. The devil collects souls. Okay, and the devil wants as many souls as it can get. So they will try to recruit your ass if you're stupid enough to recruit. And most people is is pretty selfish when it comes to life. Most people are scared of two things. Number one is to die. Number two, well, three things. Number one is to die. Number two is to be in prison. And number three is to be without money. Okay, if any one of those three things are threatened. To most people, they will sell out. They will choose to sell out and be a part of this shit. No matter what they got to do. If it comes down to you selling out or you got to die, most people sell out. Just to stay alive. And that's how they get a lot of people. That's how they get a lot of people. This person here said, uh-uh, fuck that. If it's time for me to go, it's time for me to go. That's what it is, but I'm not selling myself. That's what this person said here. Oh, you said you're going to do this, that, and the third to me? Well, whatever. I ain't running. I ain't hiding. Because that's not even how the jujitsu system, the legal system even work, bitch. Okay. And rather they setting up a motherfucker because, because the government has been known to set up motherfuckers and railroad motherfuckers right in the court of darn law. Excuse my language, y'all. Right in the court of law. They have railroaded people. You understand me? But it is still, okay, uh, a, a chain of command and how things go legally, even in a court of law. This person said, uh-uh, 
whatever. I don't believe you. Say what you want. So a part of them targeting you, them attacking you. See, because they try to instill fear in you. They try to get in your mind, invade and violate your mind to try to control you to believe what they want you to believe in order. It's all about control and manipulation. If you break down everything about the government, about the powers that be, about the structure of this world and everything that goes on, it all breaks down to two main things, manipulation and control. Without manipulation and control, you have no structure of anything. Think else is what most people don't understand. I'm trying to tell you. Spirits say these people are psychos. Spirits say these people are cowards. Spirits say these people are pure evil here. Spirits say that these people are jealous, they envious, and they intimidated by this person just because this person is awake. Just because this person uh, probably speaks truth. Just because this person is strong will, strong mind, and got a backbone. Just because this person is outspoken. Just because this person is a light worker, is intuitive, is a psychic, is a natural healer, is an empath. They jealous, envious, and intimidated by this person. Spirits say that this Cap this Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here is 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 unfortunately suffering from mental illness as well. Yeah. Spirit say that this, this Capricorn Taurus or Virgo, and it's no coincidence that they come out the same. This person has suffered with mental illness all their life. Yeah. This person, Spirit say that your girlfriend, your boyfriend, this, this, this Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here, the one that I said is around 30 something or whatever, is an informant and a spy for the police slash feds. Okay. They, they linked up also with um, Secret Seven Witches. Like there's probably a total of seven witches that it has been working together against this person to do witchcraft, sorcery, black magic, voodoo practices, all kinds of things on this person. Okay. On top of the all the illegal technology and different things that they use on this person as well. Okay. Spirit, are there any other messages that I need to share? Yeah, spirits say that they wanted this person's gifts. They wanted to strip this person. How do you want to strip somebody else of their spiritual gifts? That's just like that's just like you having a friend that can sing. You really wish you could sing, but you 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 can't sing. So you set this person up to be to, to, to be killed because you want their gift of being able to sing. That is the dumbest shit I've ever heard of. But it's literally what's going on. Mm -mm. Yeah. Spirit is saying that this ended that somebody it says somebody close to you is a warlock or a male witch. That's this person right here. Yeah. That's this uh this this older man here. This man is between the ages of 60 and, and 80 years old. He's an older man. Okay? He's an older man. He's a warlock. He's a male witch. This uh this 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 younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo here, Spirit is saying this person, this person is not only mentally ill. This person is also under MK Ultra mind control. This person is very trickable. This person is being controlled as well by the satanic powers that be. This person is technically a target themselves. But they was initiated long time ago. This is so sad about this person though. That's that's the thing about being a light worker, being intuitive, being empathic. Because you pick up the energy. I can pick up the energies of other people. This person is very wicked. Their mind is totally gone. They seriously demonic and everything. And dangerous and all kinds of. Done out all kind of evil malicious shit. But this person has suffered a lot of torture themselves. Has suffered childhood trauma themselves. Like y'all have to understand. Nobody is born like this. 
for when people are a part of this type of stuff, when people get like this, y'all need to understand that they have endured trauma, torture, pain, uh, abuse, and they have been trained to be like this. To be a part of this type of stuff. This person is suffering with mental illness. As well as this person is under MK Ultra mind control. Okay. This person also has some type of sex programming as well. Uh, under some type of sex programming as well. Um, and this is how this person is manipulated. This is how this person is controlled. And used. this person gets used and abused themselves. Okay. This person is, in fact, technically a target themselves, okay? And they are part of this, um, uh, have to stay a part of this, have to follow orders uh, just to stay alive. This person here is, Spirit is saying, is stalking and riding past your house, okay? This person stalks you and rides past your house all the time, okay? Spirit wants you to be careful of the people who are around you, okay? Especially this person, okay? Spirit wants you to know that you are very well protected by the Most High, though, okay? These people came together to do some very evil, very sinister, very wicked things to you. But um, Spirit wants you to know that you are protected, okay? Mm -hmm. Spirit, are there any other messages that I need to share with them? Uh, collective uh, pertaining to the situation oh lord <sighs> somebody might get some type of message like you might get a message from this person it's a trick it's, it's, it's a setup okay you have seen the red flags when 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 around this person when you was with this person you had an inkling you had a feeling you were sleeping with the enemy here Okay, if you ever woke up like I have before and, and, and a person is standing over you and you literally see the demon jumping, this jumping out their face and they got this demonic look on their face like they, they was about to kill you or want to kill you or something like that. You're sleeping with the enemy, man. Don't think it's no coincidence. And by the time they realize that you done got up and you aware that you see them or whatever, they'll try to change up real quick. The shapeshifters, they'll try to change up real quick. Oh, I was just coming over here to grab some, get some real quick, you know. I'm telling you. When they folks be standing over you like that, if you a light sleeper, I can, I can, I can have my eyes closed. Well, I'm a natural empath, so I can feel energy. Okay? Like... All of my senses are like um, um, magnified or, or I don't think that's the right word. It's just like, it's like I have super senses of the, uh, depending on what senses. Like it, I'm very sensitive to smell, like certain smells, certain tastes. It, it just depends on what senses that I'm using at the time. But I can be laying down, like I can hear... Like the, the 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 smallest sound, like something that most people probably wouldn't hear, okay. Um, and I can even sense, so I can be like laying down, eyes closed, asleep, or or on their way to sleep or something like that, and you could just feel something moving around, know someone is moving around, even if you don't actually hear anything moving around, you can feel. I can. It's energy. Everything is energy. Okay, just like if um, something is, is standing over you, you ever had your eyes closed and you feel like the presence of something come up and stand beside you or something like that and you open your eyes and somebody right there, somebody walked in the room or something like that. It may not be nothing suspicious. Like maybe your kid walked in the room all of a sudden you was laying down taking a nap or something. You would just feel it's energy. Okay, you can just sense. Or, and it's almost like the feeling like if you were laying out on the beach in the sun and say all of a sudden it, and you land, you, you land, um, in your lawn chair, you're on the beach, it's scorching hot, it's the sun is out, you send out tanning or something. <clears throat> say all of a sudden, if all of a sudden out of nowhere, 
the sky got really cloudy and dark, okay? The sun all of a sudden went away as if it was nighttime. Just imagine that difference in feeling, okay? And that's like the best way that I can explain it to you when 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 you can feel certain energy but yeah your senses have to be really heightened because most people can't really feel energies like that especially if you like you know a, a really hard sleeper and different things like that or whatever but um anyway that that's a different story for a different day guys okay um okay so, yeah, these people try to sacrifice you. They try to end your life, okay? Um, yeah, Spirit wants you to know that you don't need to go back to your past. Your, your past exes, family, friends, they were cut off for a reason. And it's because intuitively you knew that something was going on and all of these people were a part of it. They all end on the setup. They all sat back waiting for your demise, waiting to get the call that you was dead or injured or, or or in prison or something okay do not go back to your past okay just period spirit said beware of the snakes trying to come into your life to harm you or fool you okay these people stay all up in your business but everything about them is top secret and classified okay yeah This um this uh, younger Capricorn Taurus of Virgo here, they might have carelessly and recklessly uh, gotten pregnant by somebody as well. Um, spirits say that they put a hit out on you to have you killed to cover their tracks. So they were trying to cover up all the stuff that they had done to you by setting you up to, to have you blood sacrificed and killed, okay? Yeah, this person carelessly may have carelessly and recklessly gotten pregnant. They may have had an abortion or, or something. Okay, because like I said, this person is involved in, in other things behind the scenes or whatever. Um, they may be into role playing and different things with some of their partners that they have or whatever. Okay. Spirit, are there any other messages? This people this person come near you, any of these people. Okay, that you know is a part of this, whether they're your ex lovers, your family, your ex friends, or anything like that, ex family, whatever. Tell them, up, tell them to give you fifty feet. Okay, they don't need to come near you. Period. Point blank. I wouldn't even talk to them on the phone, honey. They wouldn't be welcome in my house, child. Okay, no, none of that. Spirit is wanting you to listen to your intuition when it comes to these individuals. Okay, <clears throat> they're stalking you. They're still stalking you. Okay. They're still stalking you, Spirit is saying. Spirit wants you to continue to protect your energy, okay? Spirit, are there any other messages? Yeah, they betrayed you. They ultimately betrayed this Queen of Cups here. A lot of disloyalty. These people are liars. They're manipulators. They got bad juju on them. They stabbed this person in the back multiple times. These people are too faced as well. They did a lot of gossip thing about um, this individual too. So you're saying be careful who you trust. These individuals, these satanic demonic individuals, they're part of this new world order here. Okay? This, this new world order beast system. Okay? They could even be working with uh, uh, royal individuals, people in royalty, people even higher up, okay? Yeah, they attacked you because you're an earth angel. This person was an earth angel that they were working against, okay? Spirit tells you, Spirit say, you know, there's nothing wrong with being alone, okay? But Spirit wants you to stop. Spirit says no new friends, okay? These people are frenemies. They're haters, okay? They have no love for you. They have an obsession for you, okay? But they do not care about you. These people are backstabbers, okay? So there's just no new friends, okay? Spirit also says that you need to release the past and you need to move in silence, okay? Because these people, these people, uh, they don't care about you. They don't love you, okay? And Spirit is going to prepare a table uh, before you in the presence of your enemies and they don't like this, okay? But... You need to let them know, okay? Don't pop up, witch, because, no, nah, your spells ain't working, okay? That's another thing that they do. 
okay? Um, as a telltale sign as well, guys, okay? When somebody has done black magic on you, when you got a person who um, you don't talk to on a regular basis, you don't see on a regular basis or anything like that, and there's been some different things that's been happening with you, going on with you and different things like that. And these people, they don't call first. They don't text or nothing that they, I come up from a place. It is disrespectful. It is disrespectful to pop up at someone's house unannounced. Okay. You get permission before you pop up at somebody's house. And that's just period. That's just out of respect. This is how I came up. I don't know about you and where you come from or whatever, but it's just out of respect. Okay, these people will pop up at your house and it's one of the main telltale signs and they do this for multiple reasons. They do this to show up to see if they witchcraft, they sorcery working. Okay, see if the, the magic that they did on you is working and different things. Okay, or as well as to, to get information out of you to go back and relay to these individuals that they linked up with. Okay. Um, they are also paying individuals to act like they like you or they love you or they're interested in you. And they're trying to send these people into your life. Okay. To be honest with you, I think it would be a great time just to heal. Um, you know, I understand nobody wants to be alone and different things like that. Nobody wants to be lonely. Everybody wants to have a significant other to be loved and different things like this. But if you are the person who is going through this type of stuff, you can't trust these individuals. You can't trust any of these people, okay? And they do not have your best interest at heart at all, okay? Just period. Just period, okay? Um, continue to protect yourself. Continue to heal yourself to the best of your abilities, honey. Take you some spiritual baths. Continue to have faith. Continue to pray. Continue to do whatever it is that you need to do in order to protect yourself and shield yourself from this negative, demonic, toxic energy here, okay? Well, thank you guys. That concludes your reading for tonight. I thank you all for listening and for watching. If you would be so kind to like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Um, for those of you who would like to contact me, you can do so at tiffanyzickler60 at gmail.com or at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. Um, or you can contact me by phone, which is 501-478-8035. For any persons who would like to donate to the channel, you can do so at um, or through Cash App, which is dollar sign tip diamond three six, or through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at three six diamond. Okay. Um, all of that information will be in the description box below, guys. Until the next time, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your babies okay this is a wicked wicked world that we live in honey there is wickedness in high places there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner even in a neighborhood near you okay so watch your surroundings watch the company you keep watch the surroundings and the company in which your children are in as well and considering the fact that you never know when somebody may betray you backstab you try to hurt you or harm you keep you some protection on you um, Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared. Because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God. Also, real quick, guys, another thing that I just thought about, um, because the, the, the stuff that they were planning um, and, and, and doing has been exposed, has been found out about, and different things like that, um, that king of coins um, individual, that older man, he, um, uh, because of the, the, the power, the money and things that he have, he might, uh, have, have sought out to sacrifice, um, that younger Capricorn Taurus or Virgo um, individual as well, okay? He may have already done so. He may be in preparation and trying to do so um, because this information got exposed, got it leaked and different things like that or whatever, uh, uh, or whatever okay? But um, 
I just wanted to throw that in there as well, okay? Because that can also be a factor to the situation. But the fact of the matter is, <clears throat> excuse me, the, uh, you know, with the entire information, um, those individuals came together to work against the specific persons. Okay. At some point, this was, this information was leaked. This information was exposed. This information was found out about. They got caught up. They got caught, um, doing the things that they were doing or, or something like that. Um, and, and, and this, um, could also have that older, uh, King of Pentacles upset right now to the point where they could even be trying to sacrifice that that the very other person that they have been dealing with that they have been working with that they have been in relations with okay so yeah it's crazy it's a whole hot mess guys but i just wanted to let that be known as well okay guys peace love and light namaste